section one, the rise of the Incas. In your textbook, please be on page 213 and 215 and briefly compare and uh, see what, what kind of geography the Incan Empire went over. And you can see that it's mostly mountainous, desert, and scrub. If you compare the key there. Um, please be on page 96 of your note-taking study guide. And uh, the question we're going to try to answer today, the main focus question is how did Incas build such a large empire? Um, and we're going to see the impact of geography on that empire and also uh, the origins of that empire as well. Okay, the first, uh, the Incan Empire uh, with geography was high elevation, cold climates, and steep slopes. This made human settlement and farming very difficult. And uh, so there's special agriculture practices that they developed because of this. Uh, the first would uh, be uh, terraces. Okay, and the purpose of this is... Um, to be able to farm on a hillside because of the steep slopes. Uh, they built irrigation canals uh, to carry water to those terraces, and you can kind of see a picture of uh, terraced farming uh, to your right, on the right side of the slide. Um, they also domesticated animals, the llama for animal, uh, to, as a pack animal and meat, apaca as soft fur, and uh, uh, visuna, which is a, a special kind of alpaca, and that um, was reserved for the finest uh, for the nobles, because it's a fine war. Okay. To look at two kind of leaders of the Incan Empire, the first one is, and I'm not sure if I'm saying this right, but the first one is Pachacuti, and the second one is uh, Hayana Kappa. Okay, so we'll do uh, Pachacuti first. And uh, he was the greatest Sapa Inca to rule, uh, more than 30 years, and um, he had a couple of contributions. The first is he expanded the empire. How he expanded his empire was he conquered other Indian peoples using diplomacy and force. Um, the, the next person we're going to talk about is uh, Hayana Kap Kapak, and he was the last Sapa Inca to rule, and he uh, did this between 1493 and 1525, uh, right before the Spanish um, came in and destroyed him. And um, he had a proper, prosperous empire um, before the Spanish soldiers invaded. You can see a kind of a rendering a picture of him there. 